Hello everyone and welcome back. Today we are going to be doing the final project of computer vision. What is it about? So the final project is about emotion and gender detection in which we are going to detect the emotion whether it be happy, sad, anger or neutral along with detecting the gender male or female. So in this project we are going to use our different types of libraries and two algorithms which are going to be really helpful. The main stars of the code. The libraries are going to be NumPy as NP, DeepFace library from Google Collab, Patches, Import CV2 and CV2 library. And then the algorithms we are going to use is DeepFace algorithm and the Har Cascade classifier. The whole motive of this project is to learn how the CCTV cameras actually work in identifying people. In a real time, there might be a thief roaming around and we need our CCTV cameras, which means our surveillance cameras, to act quickly and track them down. And this is why we're going to be doing this project and I'll be seeing you in the coding part. And here we are with the codes. First of all, we are going to import pip install deepface. Since deepface isn't in the Google Collaboratory, we are going to install it from the pip library. After doing so, we are going to import the numpy as np, google collab patches, import cv2 I'm sure. We are going to import cv2 and from deepface, we are going to import deepface, capital letters. So as you can see, these are the coordinates of our picture, which we want the size to be. And in the face one, you are going to store your image. I've got a picture of an angry girl, because that's how I was two minutes ago when my brother was annoying me. But let's not go into the details. As you can see, we have predictions, deep face analyze face one. So here we are now working, we now want deep face to work for us and analyze the picture we showed and we're going to store it in a variable called predictions and then we're going to print predictions like what is this is the prediction of deep face like the emotion is 100 angry 36 and then we have disgust and we have fear also and happy is like 0.0, .0. We can totally see that and now we're going to have p prediction is going to be dominant emotion and g gender is going to be predictions gender so now the last step of our code is to see we to put text face p and this line is basically to write of what is actually the emotion after we're going to be done with that, we're going to move on to the next part of our code, which is we import NumPy as NP, Google Collab Patches, import CV2 I'm sure, and import CV2. Don't need to import this again, but it's all right. Then we'll, I create a scenario in which you are the therapist and you have to give advice to the person. So as you can see, I created a contact number, reason and mood input and you know I asked questions like what is your age, what is your contact number, what is your reason for contacting and how is your mood, send a picture. Then we're going to store it again in phase 1, our image. Then we have our font in which we want the image, you know the writing to write on our image. We're going to put that same code which activates the deep face to write our text on the image and finally we are going to show our final picture and as a therapist as a very good therapist i gave some very excellent advice and now as you can see this is the input this is the picture and you can clearly see it says angry which means our computer is successful in detecting the emotions and here are the tips i gave so thank you so much for watching and I will see you till the next level.